Hi, welcome back. This is Sanjay Kumar Verma from Unikaksha. So my dear friend, now we are going to discuss about of the Ansible. So we know that we can create the users using of the Ansible. We can manage the servers using of the Ansible. Doesn't matter my servers are running in the physical data center or might be my servers are running in the cloud, right? So you know, using of the user module, we can create the users, right? Right? And using of the loops, we can create the multiple users. So you have any idea how to set the password of the Linux user with Ansible? Because there is no any kind of module to set the password for the user, to generate the password for the user, right? So when you are trying to planning, supply a password of the user in the plain text, that means we are going to compromise with the security, right? This is not right approach. So let's see how we work. So this is my Ansible controller, right? So here I'm going to write a playbook, right? Like uh, this is Sanjay dot yaml let me start right name creating user host where you want to execute all task what you are planning okay now name creating user so obviously you will call the user module right and here you have to share the name of the user right so my username is rf i'm supplying the uid 1416 Sorry. Okay. Shell. What kind of shell you are going to assign? Like if this is bin bash. Password. Now point is that how to set up. So should I assign the password in the plain text? right no this is not right so there are different different way to generate a encrypted password if you have an idea about of the python you can generate the password in the encrypted form otherwise we have another tool i think you heard about of the open ssl right using of the open ssl you can generate the password and you can copy the hash value and you can paste it here. And another tool is DOF code, right? Using of the DOF code, you can generate the password. So DOF code is already available in my machine. I have already installed, right? So then I will show you how to generate the password. So the command is DOVADM, right? PW hyphen S. And now here you have to share SHA 512. This is the algorithm crypt. This is the hyphen. Not understand. Okay, here you have to share the password. Retype the password. Okay. So do you know? What kind of password I set? No, the password is not available in the plain text form. So what to do? We have to copy this hash value from this dollar to this slash copy. And now 
at this location okay state should be present right now wq let me check now mc bar hyphen playbook sanjay hyphen hyphen syntax hyphen check okay and see the one more thing the username what is the username what i have set cat sanjay the username is ara let me check now the user ara is available or not in the past wd i don't have any user which name is ara right and see the one more thing vim at c shadow because this is a file where password will be available so you can see there is no user which name is ara and there is no any kind of password right so now what to do we have to run this playbook ansible hyphen playbook correct and my playbook name is sanjay enter great because we are getting the output in the gold color that means something has changed now if i hit ll hyphen d at c pass the body that means you can ch check the time stamp that something has changed in this file again i am going to verify ll space hyphen d slash at c shadow this file also modified okay so first of all we have to check vim at c pass the body yes you can see we have a user rf last one okay again i am going to verify vim at c shadow file yes this user also have a password in the last one okay great same thing you can verify on different machine yes okay it's working and now we have to shadow correct so like this you can assign the password okay so this is the idea behind of the user password so thank you so much stay safe stay home stay healthy